Hello, this is Ekushan from Twitter. Uh, today we're going to talk about uh, the tools that uh, I generally use uh, for um, for the several console scenes. Uh, there are more tools that I use, but uh, I don't have them. Uh, 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 I use as often as these tools. So, um, for example, for the PSP we have PSP Decrypt. It, it decrypts the, the PSP EPL. Um, I forgot to add to add here of the two latest version. So you can decrypt uh, the 1G EPL, the 2G EPL, and the the 03G and 05G EPLs. So uh, you can decrypt any EPL. Um, we already have the, the Kirk keys, we also have the Kirk uh, 1 key to decrypt the EPL uh, we have the, the Kirk keys to decrypt the PRXs, we have the Kirk keys to decrypt the, the update eBoots uh, we have the, um, the pre-EPL from the, from the, the 3000 uh, models uh, we have everything needed to decrypt anything from the PSP uh, except for Kirk uh, two, uh, 2 and 3 and Kirk uh, 5 and 8 so those are per console we cannot get those so um, you can see the, the tool uh, here so if you want you can give it a star I already gave it a star You can see here that uh, KL3 and KL4E uh, compression is supported, so we can d decompress anything that uses it. Uh, also, GZIP is also supported, obviously, because it's super easy to to implement. Um, G uh, you can you can also uh, um, extract uh, GKICS. Uh, and also test test kit firmware and yeah uh, decrypts PRX, PRX files so yeah um, so we have another here from cubic 2 which is by sweeper you use this with uh, with uh, specially craft uh, Pandora uh, machine, well, it's not a battery because it, it it acts like the battery, but it's not it's not like a battery. You use this to unbreak uh, the system. For example, to to install the M33. Uh, you can see here the required tools. You need to to do this to enter the the service mode. You can see here that uh, they use the K line, which is uh, TX and RX, and at the same time for the communication, uh, the minus goes to ground, the plus goes to the, to the voltage levels, etc. So this is just for unbreaking. Um, you can see here the supported models, etc. So. For the PS3 you have uh, the SCE tool, except this one is not NARWARDS, this one is based off NARWARDS, but it's not, uh, it's not um, completely, um, uh, it's not complete, uh, the, the NARWARD one is, is, is lacking several st things, like support for, uh, for all the prototype uh, modules etc and this one is more more, more complete you can see here uh, my friend uh, Sorvigolov also added uh, the PS3 keys here and he also uh, is using the most of most of the names are official Sony names so if you s if you take a look at the code you can see most uh, official Sony names used. Uh, so besides this, 
uh, yes, and of course it decrypts PS3 cells, ISO cells, and SPRXs. So, uh, yeah, and very important, it conserves the symbols table when decrypted. Uh, besides that, we have my own uh, PS3 tools, which is based heavily on uh, on the failover flow um, PS3 tools. Uh, it's mostly for um, for uh, for exploding the the pops and the boot ROMs. You can see here the boot ROM explode for most for most uh, normal uh, boot ROMs. The ones for 060 uh, boot ROMs and the ones for the decry decrypted boot ROMs, which are re really really old. Uh, you can also see here the pop explode. Also another script and the other, the other, the other scripts here. Uh, well, not not scripts, but C code. Uh, here you can find a copy of the um, of the Sorvigolovas SCE tool source code. Uh, the latest one being used. Uh, you can see here how how to set up the keys, etc. Uh, for the PSP and PS, PSP2 uh, or PS Vita as they call it, you can use Pulp Fiction. If you go here, you can use this Pulp Fiction, which is a drag, drag and drop, uh, is executable, executable made by Socratic Bliss uh, it's based off Pop Fiction from Team Molecules uh, SCE Utils so this uses uh, uh, Pop Fiction but it's three different models for uh, internal pops external pops and proto external pops um, up until the, the plain text cells uh, there's an exception. 0 0.902 is not support. For the Nintendo Switch, which, uh, which I already covered in a in a video, uh, you can see uh, uh, of uh, Cyrezm uh, Act Two, which decrypts Switch firmwares, and the keys are required. You can see it here. I believe he has a, a repository for for releases. Let me see. Yes, it's here. So yeah, it's not. It decrypts a lot of switch formats. So say files, package one, package two, etc. So it's really really useful if you want to uh, to decrypt the switch firmware and uh, analyze it. So for 3DS, it, there is an identical tool, but it's called uh, the CTR tool. It can be found here on the 3DS guy uh, repository for Project CTR. And uh, it comes bundled with Make ROM, which creates a ROM. CTR tool. Supports XFS, RAMFS, etc. In in general, very similar to um, to the hack tool that's used on the on the switch uh, firmware. So yeah, that's that's all for today. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed the video, uh, and um, I hope you uh, enjoy the the lovely evening or day that you're having so thank you very much